Hey you guys, so today I wanted to talk to you guys about freedom of thought. And I'm sure I have kind of touched on this in a couple of my videos in one way or another, but it really pertains a lot to what's going on in the world today, particularly in the United States. And well within the disabled community. And other communities across the country as well, outside of elections and things like that. Just because we look the same doesn't mean that we have to think the same. This is a problem that I have with a lot of people in wheelchairs because like I've said before I know I've said this I can't have a surface level friendship or relationship of any kind with people if all we're going to talk about is our disability I don't want to be friends with you I don't need you in my life so why then do we all have to think alike just because we look alike why is it not okay to disagree anymore without demonizing I don't have an answer to that question because I think it's perfectly fine to disagree without either party being a bad person or without insults like privileged or any of the other shitty things that people say coming into play. There's absolutely no reason for it. And maybe if there was less assumption over what a person is and less hurt feelings over it and more critical thought towards it, we would get somewhere as a country. Too many people in their freaking feelings, man. And they're blind to what's going on around them. And that's the way that the powers that be want it. They want you brainwashed. And it drives me freaking crazy. And as far as the disabled community, you can take this way beyond the powers that be of the government. Doctors want you brainwashed to keep coming to them because you can't do this, that, and the other on your own. You need this, that, and the other surgery to fix A, B, and C. You're not allowed to be okay with the way that you are. You need to constantly be trying to be perfect like everybody else. No, it's perfectly fine to embrace a disability. You're not settling for anything. You're embracing the life that you were given. And I know this is all over the place right now. It's like one in the morning and I just got really fired up to make this video. <sighs> but I'm just frustrated. I'm just, this is the freest country in the freaking world. And we're not so free right now. We're being pitted against each other and people don't even see it. Because they're so wrapped up in their feelings and being hurt.
get over it and open your eyes and just do a little research figure out what's going on and don't let yourself be pitted against people don't allow yourself to feel ashamed of the way that you think because what you're thinking is an evil you're not thinking with those talking points that they shove down your throat and in your mouth. The swamp exists on the left and the right. And we're all just Americans looking at each other like what the fuck is happening. Something big is happening. And it might look like a mess right now. But I think it's gonna work out. The biggest gift that we're given in this country and as human beings is freedom of thought and freedom of speech. Use it. <laughs>